So guys, sad, sad news. Subriel, uh, Matias stops Maxim Dashadev in the 11th round. Um, but I think there's more heartbreaking news uh, rather than reporting on a fight. Although, you know, um, Matias got the win, got the stoppage. After Dashadev left the ring, uh, he got ill, uh, seriously ill, um, and he was rushed to hospital. And the reports are that he had two hours surgery on his brain. Um, and they had to reduce the swelling on his brain and part of the skull was removed. Um, it's really, really sad news. This is why we report on boxing. We love the sport, but sometimes, you know, these incidents can happen in, in boxing where someone gets seriously hurt. And you hope you know, for his family's sake, for his sake, that he's probably never going to box again, but hopefully he can make a speedy recovery so he can go back safe to his family because, you know, that would be tragic if uh, somebody ends up losing his life or or is not the same person that, you know, went into the ring. Because that's what happens in boxing. Sometimes you go into the ring and you come out a vegetable. It can happen. You know, Adonis Stevenson has made a recovery. I'm not sure how well he is, but I know he's made a recovery and he even gave, uh, I think, an interview. To Bobby, so he's not that bad. Um, you know, but still, you know, there was there was a serious concern and now there's serious concern on Dashadev because we hope he can make a speedy recovery because this is, this, you know, if, if he doesn't, that'd be heartbreaking. You know, we don't know. I don't know whether he's critical right now. I'm pretty sure he is. There hasn't been... You know, I don't I'm not sure whether he's stable, um, but from just the reports coming out that a part of his skull has been removed and they've had two hours surgery on his brain. Um, he fell ill as soon as he left the ring. And that's the thing. A lot of these injuries, they don't happen right away. They normally take time and then they and then it takes effect after an hour or half a half an hour, 45 minutes after the fight. You know, you start you collapse and then you have then you you know, get rushed to hospital. And that's happened with quite a few guys, to be honest. Uh, some of some fighters have been ill in the ring. You know, oh, it's just it's just sad. It's just sad, you know, to see these guys um, get hurt. You know, Watson was one um, that got injured here um, when with his fight with Eubank. Um, you know, there's another one. There's an, uh, another one, Nick Blackwell, who fought Chris Eubank, son. Uh, so Chris Eubank, senior and junior, have had experiences. You know, uh, with people getting hurt in the ring. So it's it's a tough one. You know, boxing. Although we love the sport and we love it, and we're looking forward to Keith Thurman and Pacquiao. There's always this. There's always um, these moments that make make you feel down and gloom that this is a very dangerous sport and people can get seriously hurt in it and this is why you got to respect all the participants that take part in the sport because you know they're putting their lives on the line for our entertainment so you know it's a difficult video uh but i, I wish dashadev um all the best um hopefully he can pull through it and and you know continue on with his life but leave your thoughts guys and guys remember to please like share and subscribe to my channel i'll see you guys in the next video